ho, 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 and Merry Christmas, everyone. Welcome to the 23rd episode of Deck Wars, which is going out on Christmas Eve. That's why I said ho, ho, ho. It, was it necessary for you to explain the joke? Yes. Yes, it okay. was. Okay, so, okay. As some of you probably can see, we I we did a little bit of changing to the wheel. It's much more colorful. It's like it's for right month, but it's not. So yeah. Uh, what we decided to do is do a similar thing that we did on Halloween, but in reverse. Instead of a plethora of bad effects of detrim or detrimental, if you will, well, we're having a bunch of very fun and good effects on a separate wheel that will help us do other stuff. Not going to spoil anything for now, at least. So, YT, how, how are you feeling after taking that victory last time? I'm feeling really fine right now. I hope your Christmas gift for me is a victory on a victory of the match for today's episode. Well, we'll see about that. So, without further ado, let's start spinning. Let's go. And winner. Okay. So, I got my deck already. Wait, do you have yours? I have my deck indeed. Perfect. So, now, this is our Wheel of Good Fortune. This wheel will be spun four times, every time giving us a different effect that we'll have to oblige during our duel. So, without further ado, let's see what the Wheel of Good Fortune will give us. And the wheel in the season, I guess, in the what happening, gave us three mandatory Santa Claus in the deck. In the spirit nice. of this season. The and the Santa. next thing we will do is add a one card of our choice to the deck. So I think that was yours, so you're intending on from the pool or from what was we have more than 10,000 cards in the Yu-Gi-Oh world so you can choose one of those 10,000 cards Bitchin. for free okay and next one is two cards from your choice from a previous episode so we're adding two cards from a structure deck that we already played. Oh, this is this is getting good. This is getting very good. And the final one, the final spin is for adding one banned card to the deck. One nice. card that is currently banned is getting added to your deck. Nice. nice. I'm a Please man. remember that you have to still oblige by the ban list restrictions. Yeah, of course. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we have our detrimental wheel, which is going to not be very nice to us. Let's see how it's going to ruin our Christmas. <laughs> oh, holy shit. And it's changing all bandless restrictions to Mega Band. Oh, sh oh I, I didn't want that. Okay. <laughs> okay, but there is one thing that's... Uh, that's really bothering me right now. Yeah, tell me. Because we're adding one banned card to the deck, but every yes. but all the ban list restrictions are mega banned, so everything is banned. So we still you add. Have a limit... Yes. Okay. Yeah, but I, I every... think that's fine. So that's, you... that's fair. Okay. 
So we are going to start building our decks, I guess. And we will see you after this. Bye. See you. And welcome back to this very joyous episode of Deck Wars. So, YT, what did you get from our wheel? Yes, let's go find that. Well, I asked Santa if I could be like some of the big names of the community and it grant my wish on this episode of the Wars. But there's no appliance for structure deck. Uh, um, <laughs> I'm going to omit my comments on that because I'm going to be playing what Distant Coder play on week one on their season the episode. And I'm playing a structure deck Zombie yes, Master, I don't know what the, call, the name is called. Zombie Heart. I think it was oh. the last zombie. Day. So that's Which the one with the you? Red Eye Zombie Dragon Retrain, the Synchro. Yes, and the best monster for zombies, the Doom King Battle Rock, because what is an Golden Lord LT. Oh, and the ban list is. Sorry for setting you out the, the there. Ban list. If I remember correctly, is August 2018, I think. Let me search real quick. It was mid. Um, it was mid uh, of the year, I think. But it's. It, it was released. I don't know. Let me search quickly. Okay. So it's September 2018, at least. So it was released in November 2018. Okay. So, when it comes to me, the wheel decided to gift me Starter Deck 2013, which was released in the TCG under the name Super Starter V4 Victory in June 2013. Are you feeling the flow? Oh, definitely. Oh, most definitely. The, the deck follows the March 2014 ban list, and just for to say it out loud, the cover card is number C39 Utopia Ray. So I'm definitely feeling the flow. Perfect. Let's see how you measure against the zombie horde and all the power of the Christmas Oh, let's miracle. see. Oh, please also remember that we all have three mandatory copies of uh, of Santa Claus, one banned card, one card of our choice, and two cards from a previous deck, from a previous episode. Sure. So, let's go. Okay, so I am starting. Okay. So, I will start by summoning Goblinburg and activating his effect, chaining yes. to it my Kage to Kage. Really nice, okay. In summoning, in summoning Gagaga Magician. Now nice. I activate Wonder Wand and equip it to Gagaga Magician and draw two cards. After which, I am going to XC summon number 39 Utopia and equip it with XC's unit, okay. boosting its attack even further. Sure, okay, perfect. Um, I'm going to. <clears throat> I'm going to start. By normal summoning, I'm sorry, I'm just... Okay. Okay, cool. By normal summoning, Shinano is solitaire. Okay. I will activate its effect, tributing itself. Fine. Summon Unizombie. Unizombie, of course. Um, Seriously, that was in the structure deck? Or did you take Unizombie? This is from uh, Structure Deck, so... Oh! I will activate Unisombie effect to send from the deck. 
Okay. I will send Neverworld Banshee. <sighs> Activate her effect. Okay. Activating zombie war. Okay, that is fine. Uni zombie effect from the hand. Sending glow boom. Okay. Triggering its effect by vanishing it to summon Donkey Ballet Rock. Mm, big boy. The big boy has hit the field. I will set three cards face down. And I will end my turn. Okay, fine. It's my move. I draw! Malrock will still revive itself. Yes, that's why it's really powerful. So I'll just go ahead and smash it. I will activate zombie power stroll. Target one zombie on the field gains or loses a thousand attack. Okay. Oh, it's... But number monsters can... Oh wait, that's only in the end. Exactly. <laughs> exactly, that's the full point of this. Okay. Mm, nice draw, okay. Uh, I will send... I will come as someone Kosuki. Oh jeez. Activate effect. Chain okay. Body Rock. I will banish the number 39 Utopia from the... No! Dashing through the sand with a bomb trap to my back. And I will send to my graveyard um I got through checkpoint A, but not through checkpoint B. That's when I got shot in the ass by the US. Okay, I will send Global Bloom, which will trigger again. And I will summon Red Eyes Zombie Dragon. Oh. So a card that destroyed you in one of our previous episodes. Yes. I will activate... Um... Uni Zombie. Target... The... Red Eye Zombie Dragon. Okay. Sent... The... No, jeez. I'll activate zombie power struggles effect. What does that do? Uh, return one of my banished zombies to the deck to sell itself. Okay, that is fine. It will go banish when it leaves itself. Okay, that is I will go to the fine. Fine. Go, I activate the effect of my Gaga -ga Guard, no. Mm. Protect me! Don't worry. I will replay and attack the Gaga -ga Guard, no, sorry. I will not do that. <laughs> yes, that do that, too. do that. That's a genius move. With the red eyes I activate girl. the effect of my Gaga -ga -ga Guard, no. I will chain Doom Kimball and Rock to negate. <sighs> he can do one of each each turn, doesn't he? I will activate Red Eyes Zombie Dragon. Summoning the Gardener back to the field. Oh, jeez. Mm. Yes, but now we get to the interesting part. Get our guy. Let's see what you got. Okay. 
Okay. I will activate return of no, my guard, your guard, nah. Oh, but it summons some defense. Yeah. Okay. What is reading? I will end my okay. turn. Okay. And I will turn, end my turn on that. I will. Zombies OP, please nerf. Activate return of the zombies. Re recycling the globe of bloom back to the deck to set itself. Okay. <laughs> Eat my strings, guitar guy. Mm. Maybe you should practice some, eh? I will change so Mesuki to attack. Um, attack. I attack. Do you have the second Gaga Gardner? It wouldn't help me because Gaga Gardner special summons itself in attack position. There we go. Zombie too strong prisoner. Yes, definitely. Oh, definitely. Okay. I kill you. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. So I want to go second. Okay. I will. Hmm. But not through checkpoint three. That's when okay. I got shot in the ass by the US military. Oh, jingle. I will normal summon Necro War Banshee. Okay, her effect. Fine. Get it in the sound war. Set two cards face down and then my turn. Okay, I can live with this. I can live with this. Okay, so now I'm going to show you one of the cards I added from the from one of our previous episodes. Sure. And that is my Pot of Greed! Nice. I'll end my turn by placing three cards face down. Your move. Sure. I will normal summon zombie master. Okay, that is fine. I will go to the world face and attack. I will activate my Gaga -ga Gardener. Sure. Summoning it back to the field. Again. What else he said? Okay, I will still continue the attack on Gaga -ga Gardener. I activate the effect of Gaga -ga Gardener. Sure. You will still take the damage. Yes. <laughs> I still take the damage. I will end the turn of that. On that. I will activate my dust tornado, destroying your zombie world. It's my move. So now I summon Zexal Weapon Unicorn Spear. Okay. And now you will see the monster that I added from the all of the card pool. Sure. Go ahead. Because I exceed summon number thirty-nine Utopia Double. Uh, would be nice. That's a nice card. And I've added double or nothing. You're lucky that you destroyed the zombie world. Go! Utopia I'm double! Dead. Attack! I think I'm dead. Sure. Now I activate the effect of Utopia. And go quick play spell double or nothing. Okay. Sure. And now my Utopia can attack your zombie master. Okay, so that will be game. Sure. Must be nice. Okay. <laughs> that that combo of Utopia Double is pretty much the only way I can win. Exactly. Basically, that's the only thing that you can do. Um, I want to go second in this case. Okay. Well, 
Hmm. Go. Because I'm pretty sure you have the Banshee already. I will normal summon Yuni Zombie. Or you have that. Yuni Zombie effect, this card in Necro World Banshee by targeting itself. Did I just call it or did I just call it? Yes, <laughs> the access to this thing is pretty powerful. Uh, Uni Zombie effect targeting itself, sent from the deck. Okay. And it's a bloom, bloom effect. That is fine. Also, on Bailey's Rush. I'll proceed to the battle phase. Okay, that is fine. That's when I got shot in the ass by the US military. Attack. Attack. Okay, I'm going to laugh extremely if that is going to work. Um, I will proceed to the. Uh, do you have the Santa Claus plus the combo? Question. You do have this in the close plus the combo, okay. Now I summon Goblin Berg. Yes. Activate its effect. To summon the okay. Weapon Unicorn Spear. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Which I'm going to use to exceed summon Utopia Double. <laughs> Thank you, Santa Claus. Ah, screw it, I'm gonna flex. Sure. I'll tribute your Santa Claus for, for another Santa Claus. Okay. Everything for the spirit of the season. Adding that that utopia double pulled its weight. Uh, yes, okay. On a side note, what band card did you add to the deck? Uh, Pot of Greed. I added Pot of Greed as one of the cards we had from a previous episode. From previous episodes, I added the enemy controller because, of course, mm -hmm. very powerful card. Okay. And from the pool, I added Link to Rebo. So, uh, from from the pool, like you just saw, I added Utopia Double. Yes. Because it's Utopia fucking Double. Uh, from the two cards from previous episodes, I, because we, we could add two, I added Pot of Greed and Pot of Avarice. Yes. And for the band card, I chose Sixth Sense. Nice. As I, I was debating of adding the Foolish Burial, but that was not going to work, honestly. You had enough, you had enough Foolish-like effects already on monsters. Yes. Unizombie, you had Shuren Lewis Hunter, which searches Unizombie. Probably should have added Mirror Force, just in case this could happen. Yeah. Instead of the zombie necronite. Mm. Okay, so I I take this. <laughs> yes. So we but are. I, it, um, it wasn't it wasn't actually a full uh, structure deck win because I won only thanks to Utopia Double. Was there any way that you could summon Utopia Rape or Utopia Victory? Actually. Uh, no, the the deck doesn't have Utopia Ray Victory. It only Which has the know? it only has the standard Victory. Utopia Ray. Maybe you should oh. practice some of that. The and first one. That the, and you can summon that exactly how on that. Uh, day. By overlaying regular Utopia. Oh, so it, 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 it doesn't doesn't it doesn't need a rank up. It's a rank okay. four. Okay, that's a nice deck, not gonna lie. 
Yeah, so that is a thing that happened. So yeah. Yes, that. So that would be it for today. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Happy Holidays, Happy Hanukkah, and whatever you're actually uh, you're actually celebrating right now. I quite frankly don't care, and because I love you all. Mwah. Except some of you were probably <laughs> No, ex except everyone who plays Counter Frames. So, okay. See you next week on the final episode of the year. Bye bye. See ya.